Hello guys, this is Outrage, the owner of Outrage Games. In this tutorial we are going to do a simple walking animation that will also work on slopes. This will be the final result. I'm going to keep it very simple. First of all, I'm going to add this flat ground and add a 2D box collider to it. Now I'm going to add a rigid body 2D to the player, change the mass and gravity a little bit and add a capsule collider too. You can modify it as you want. Also change the sorting layer of the ground so that it's behind the player. Now let's create a working script and add it to the player. We need three variables. The speed of the player, a rigid body 2D component, and the float for the input that's going to check whether we press the left or the right arrow. In the start function, I'm going to set the rigid body equal to the player's rigid body component. In the update function, we're going to set the move input variable equal to the horizontal input of the user. That means that if the player presses the left arrow button, the variable is going to be minus 1. If he presses the right arrow button, it's going to be 1. And if he doesn't press anything, it's going to be set to 0. Now, we change the horizontal velocity of the player according to the move input age variable. The vertical velocity is not affected. Ok, so now the walking system is ready. Just remember to freeze the rotation of the z-axis or this will happen. Cool. Now we have to do two things. One is to make him turn according to his direction and second, add the walking animation whenever he walks. First of all, I will add a walking boolean parameter to the animator and make the animation transitions as shown. Walking is true when he walks and it turns false when he doesn't. Remember to remove exit time. Now, back in the script. I'm going to create an animator variable and set it equal to the player's animator. In the update function, I am making him turn depending on his direction. Now I check whether or not he walks. If so, the walking animation is going to play. Pretty simple, right? If you have any questions, be sure to ask me in the comments. Ok, now it's time to put slopes in the game. I'm going to add the polygon collider on this one. As you can see, we cannot climb the small slope. I will fix it by applying a physics material 2D without friction to the player.
but now the player sleeps. So, the solution is to make another physics material with friction and swap to it whenever the player stays still. In the script, I'm going to create two public physics materials 2D variables in which I'm going to apply the two materials I created. Now, if the player is not moving, apply the one with the friction, else apply the one without friction. And that's it. Don't forget to put the slope on the background sorting layer so that it's behind the player. Thanks for watching. You can find the script on my Discord channel. Make sure to subscribe for more tutorials like this one. Comment if you have any questions. See you in the next one.